Paying tribute to past icons by wearing their jersey numbers is fine and well, but some players have unique and personal stories behind the numbers they choose. For some, it may be a tragic incident and for others, it might be to remember great players of the NBA's past. In today's video, I take a look at the real story behind why Kevin Garnett wore number 21. Welcome to NBA Insider. Kevin Maurice Garnett was born on May 19, 1976 in South Carolina. As a high school student, Garnett was a 1995 McDonald's All-American, won a National Player of the Year award, and excelled as an outstanding basketball player. Because of this, he entered the 1995 NBA draft where he was selected with the fifth overall pick by the Minnesota Timberwolves and became the first NBA player drafted directly out of high school in 20 years. In late September 2016, after spending 21 seasons in the NBA, the power forward slash center announced his retirement from the league. Behind him, he left a legacy as one of the best defensive players and a personality that future basketball generations will speak on in years to come. He was a revolutionary player who shaped basketball history in many important ways, but behind every legacy stands a story of even greater importance. Before Kevin Garnett had fully established himself as an NBA superstar, before he won an NBA title and made his claim to becoming a future Hall of Famer, and before he became a player that rookies looked up to for advice, Kevin Garnett looked up to a player by the name of Malik Seeley. Seeley was an NBA player who played eight seasons with three different NBA teams before finding himself playing for the Minnesota Timberwolves. The 6'8", 200-pound small forward was born in the Bronx, New York and attended St. John's University before becoming the 14th pick in the first round by the Indiana Pacers back in 1992. After three seasons with the Pacers, he played two years with the Los Angeles Clippers and one with the Detroit Pistons before signing with the Timberwolves as a free agent. He was known as a key defensive player who did the little things. He was also a reliable perimeter shooter averaging 11.3 points and shooting a career high 47.6% from the field. But most importantly, he was a good friend. Garnett and Seeley became close friends and teammates while they were with the Minnesota Timberwolves in the 1999 NBA season. That season was Malik Seeley's best in the NBA so far and he was so close to posting career highs across the stat sheet. Kevin Garnett admired how hard Seeley worked on his game, how respectfully he treated others, and how he wasn't too focused on only being known as a basketball player. Off the court, Seeley was also an aspiring actor and had a major role as a basketball player in a 1996 movie called Eddie. He also made appearances on plenty of TV shows. In addition to all of this, Seeley also designed ties and clothing and owned a company called Malik Seeley Incorporated. Because of all of this and the fact that he was his idol, when Kevin Garnett first came into the league to play for the Timberwolves, he chose the jersey number 21 because it was worn by Malik in college at St. John's. Malik Seeley on the other hand was wearing the jersey number 2. And although Garnett and Seeley only played one full season together, the friendship between the two of them was a bond that developed quickly and would never be broken. At least that's what everyone thought. Following Game 1 of the Western Conference Finals between the Los Angeles Lakers and the Portland Trailblazers, the NBA observed a moment of silence after receiving some shocking news. On Saturday, May 20, 2000, Kevin Garnett was celebrating his 24th birthday with his family and friends. One of those friends was of course none other than Malik Seeley. After finishing what was supposed to be a night of happiness, Malik Seeley left the birthday party at around 4am and headed on his way home. While he was driving back to his house, his Range Rover was hit head-on by a Dodge pickup truck driven by a 43 year old man. The owner of the pickup truck was traveling on the wrong side of the highway when he struck Seeley's SUV which did not have an airbag to cushion him during the fatal crash. When police arrived on the scene, they learned that the driver had almost double the amount of the legal blood alcohol limit at the time of the crash. It was later on discovered that he'd been convicted of drunk driving three years previously. The driver who caused the crash was hospitalized in serious condition. Malik Seeley on the other hand was instantly killed. He was 30 years old. Timberwolves guard, NBA veteran Malik Seeley died as a result of a head-on car collision in suburban Minneapolis. His sports utility vehicle was hit by a pickup truck which was going the wrong way on a highway. Seeley was returning from teammate Kevin Garnett's birthday party at the time of the crash. The driver would eventually be convicted of criminal vehicle homicide, serve three years of a four-year sentence for Malik's death, and be released three years later in 2003. But even with his conviction, the wounds of that night still haven't healed. 
Sam Mitchell, a former teammate with Seeley and Garnett, was the Minnesota player that rang the doorbell at Seeley's house that fateful night and told Malik's wife of the tragedy. When Kevin Garnett received news of Malik's death from his aunt, the wonderful memories of a birthday celebration suddenly turned into complete sadness. He immediately went into a state of shock. Garnett recalls the incident by saying it felt like time had stopped. This was a natural reaction for him considering Garnett was the last person Malik Seeley saw before his untimely death. And although Malik Seeley died way too young with too much to live for, his legacy lives on through his son Malik Remington Seeley and his wife Lisa. But most importantly, his name lives on through Kevin Garnett. Upon being traded from the Boston Celtics to the Brooklyn Nets in July of 2013, Garnett changed his jersey number to number 2 in honor of Seeley who had worn the number during their time together on the Timberwolves. That blockbuster trade gave Garnett the opportunity to pay tribute to his close friend for the last time. In his homecoming to Minnesota on February 25, 2015, Kevin Kevin Garnett wore a number 2 sweatband on his left forearm in memory of his best friend. Garnett was also prepared to wear the number 21 for Malik when he played for the Boston Celtics, but he couldn't do that because that number had already been retired which is why he resulted to wearing the number 5. But the loyalty never stopped there. Kevin Garnett also paid tribute to Malik by writing to Malik in the inside of the Adidas Garnett 3 shoes and wrote Seeley's jersey number in the inside of his shoes before every single game he played. To top it all off, Kevin Garnett and ex-NBA player Joel Smith got Seeley's name tattooed on their right arms following the tragedy. When they would face against one another over the course of the 2000s, the two would bump their arms with the tattoos as a respectful tribute to their late friend. When asked about the tattoo, Kevin Garnett would say, It was only right to honor someone that I respected so much and I have a lot of respect for who he is as a person more than anything. It was only right to pay homage to a dear friend of mine. Above and beyond basketball, everyone admired Malik for the special person that he was. Malik was a wonderful person who touched everybody in a special way. Malik Seeley was a stellar contributor to the NBA, his team, and his community. Garnett would continue on by saying, If you knew Malik, you knew he was a giver first. He was a very, very intelligent, very high intellect guy and someone that I was dear to. He was dope. He was cool for the time that I knew him and I'm thankful he came into my life. Now, every year when Kevin Garnett celebrates his birthday, he is reminded of the night he lost one of his closest friends. And although Although the Minnesota Timberwolves retired his jersey and he was inducted into the St. John's Hall of Fame, Malik Seeley was still a passionate individual with true hunger and determination. As Kevin Garnett's right-hand man, Malik Seeley went out as a true Timberwolf. Unfortunately for us, his life was sadly and tragically taken away. But these are just some of the behind the scenes of the NBA that many people don't know about. When you put aside the multi-million dollar contracts and fancy cars that many NBA stars enjoy, there is a lot to learn about some of your favorite players on a more personal level. The NBA is more than just basketball. It's a place where friendships are made, accomplishments are appreciated, and sadly, deaths are mourned. But luckily for us, it is also thanks to players such as Kevin Garnett that we get to appreciate individuals such as Malik Seeley. Now the NBA remembers Malik for more than just a player. They remember the father. They remember the husband. They remember the friend. And that concludes the video. As always, if you enjoyed this video and would like to see more content, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. If I made any mistakes or missed anything that you felt should have been included, please let me know. Also, if you have any recommendations for future videos such as interesting stories or topics like this, please feel free to leave them in the comment section down below. As always, thanks for watching, NBA Insider.